Hello everybody, welcome back to the Advanced Captain's Edition. Um, last run was with the Mother Hen Federation Medivac. Now it's time for something else. We're going once again off track. Reason for it being is that there's a new mod in the now already called the Bio and the Collab. Um, this one. I've outsourced. By that I mean I switched roles. It was time for my co-creator Arnie stuff to get his hands dirty with super luminal and whatnot, and I let him do all of this fancy work. Um, I don't think you want to keep staring at this, so we're just gonna shove the ship straight away. There you have it, the automaton or automaton. Yes, I've done little to nothing to the ship. I've just provided the hull images as they stood original and uh, some small coding that needed to be done for systems and stuff like that. Other than that, I've done nothing to this ship. Um, so let's go over it. It's not a rare ship. Uh, if we go to the list and actually read the tiny description, a collaboration between NG and slug scientists of the Federation to replicate the rogue AIC double. One result in the creation of AIC002, aka the Automaton. AIC001 is a reference back to the anomaly. Speaking of the anomaly, um, for those playing the ship without Captain's Edition, do not install both at the same time. Uh, the anomaly will run fine. The problem will be that artillery will be offered in stores even when playing with the Automaton here. It doesn't work, alright? The artillery is there, but it's only for those playing with Captain's Edition. Keep that in mind. Um, other than that, you can. I mean, it's still got the slug repair gel, and it has the slug repair gel blue option remover that the anomaly has, so no fancy piracy stuff can be done with it. Um, other than that, time to go over the specs. Uh, another thing, he removed the arms from the auto constructor. I kind of like it. That those are gone. Uh, they didn't seem to serve any real purpose. The ship has nothing to do with construction anymore, so it really didn't need them, did it? Um, forum post is not up yet at the time of this recording. It will be at the time this gets uploaded. There will probably be a fancy smancy story to it. Unfortunately, I cannot read out loud to you guys. Anyway, let's talk about the ship itself. So, it's an AI ship, which means all the benefits from it, as you've known from the anomaly, that is. Constantly manned sensors and all the other systems as well. So I tell about sensors specifically because that even works in Nebulas and you even get level 3 sensors against the flagship, which is kind of unique. Um, same thing with losing crew members when you don't have any will crash the game. Um, auto repairs on systems except for breaches, which is why we once again have the slug repair gel. Um, and I think that's pretty much where most of the similarities end. On to this one specifically, I think that immediately springs to mind is you're missing a weapon system. Uh, you do not miss weapons, you miss just the entire system. It is available in store for purchases. The default price has been adapted from 20 to 50. Um, yes, default pricing for weapons is 20, but seeing how there is no single ship out there that starts without weapons, you probably never have encountered. This one has 50. As has been stated as well by my co-creator Arnie stuff, and I don't know if I should call myself a co-creator because I didn't really do too much to it. Um, crap, I've lost my train of thoughts now. Um, blah, 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 what was it? Yes, the fall pricing is twenty. It's been changed to fifty. When you buy it, you get only level one weapon, so you will have to spend another forty in for your second bar as well, which is one way to deter people from getting weapons. Although weapons are pretty crucial. Um, another thing, it's sporting a custom combat drone, um, I'll show it. An upgraded version of the combat drone Mark II, taking 25% less power while or shooting at a faster rate. Um, yes, because someone had issues with piercing a level 1 shield with this thing. So we've, and by, well, we, yeah, I think I can say we... Um, made it so it sh moves a bit faster and just increasing the speed on drones will make them fire faster as well. Start off with a system repair drone to uh, do your average repair stuff. C take care of breaches when the slug repair gel isn't doing anything and just make sure you don't have to wait four hours after combat for all your systems to repair again. 
Um, another thing, you start off with just this, and your alternative is the abduction strategy, which is mind controlling enemy crew while teleporting them over. Seeing how there's not a lot of air on board, we'll quickly dispatch of most enemy crew. Um, this ship does not have an anti boarding drone. I don't think it's called anti boarding drone, more of an anti personnel drone. Meaning Lanny's attacks will be in a nuisance because you might get two at the same time, sure you can get them to kill one another, but you're still left with that one Lanny's crew member who you can't really kill off. The only thing you can do is just continuing on and hoping you find a, an enemy ship that has a teleporter and that he teleports him off for you. Um, or you can hope that he gets shot by a weapon, but you know, there's that. Um, what else? Uh, yes. I talked a bit about artillery before. For those playing Captain there is an artillery. It's the UA form artillery on the NG A ship. Maybe even the C one. I can't be entirely sure. But it's kind of like a pulsar that has a chance to miss every shot that comes in. As in, the pulsar cannot miss the artillery, and this one can. Um. As always, all systems are available for purchase that aren't here, except for artillery when you're not playing Captain's Edition. Uh, other than that, well, you start off without weapons, that's kind of unique, I saw it happen on one ship before, but whatever. Anyway, I think this is enough talking. Um, I'm going to check my recording, and uh, that means I can already save this, which means I don't have to do my explanation again, in case something does end up going wrong. Alright, let's go! Make a drone manufacturer. Good. Don't know one to talk to. This is a problem by not having weapons. That'll fix itself out once we do get weapons. If we ever get weapons. Because apparently it could take a while. Because it doesn't. Uh, sure. You know, we're still early on. What do I care, right? That's the leftover thing I have from. Um. Playing on hard mode. Alright, one hit on weapons and we are safe. And that's not weapons. That's not weapons. That's not weapons. That's weapons. There you go. <coughs> Only took you half a day. Okay, um, so yeah, the abduction strategy is what we will be going with here, because you get more scrap. And it looks like that's something you will need, a lot of. We had a debate, well, a debate, more like, maybe you should do that, he said no, and I said, okay, it's your ship, do what you want. Um about whether or not it was a good idea of if you buy weapons it would only have one power bar in it can't do that so we'll have to fight we are not safe we need to hit on weapons yeah shooting drones is there we go we're safe ah oh, no now you're gonna go repair that that's not what i wanted actually but now it's fine again. We'll port you over. Now you can actually do some damage to my ship if I would have let you do that. Stop. We don't have anything to fear anymore. But fear itself. Are you going to destroy that? Mm, yes. Indeed. Lucky me. Almost thought I would get away with it. Huh. That can't happen. Anyway. Let's take the Rockman on board. Uh, wait, what? Can I? Is that a drone? Repair drone over? No, I can't. <laughs> Odd. Odd and weird. Would've been fun, though. Look at all this drone spazzing out. Hey, hey, hey! You think that's funny? Do you? Alright. <clears throat> Distress. We got a repair drone which might be able to be used. Depends on the... Ah, uh, shoot at it. 
Alright, this would be another good point for me to restart. And I probably would have if I was playing on hard, but you know, I can't keep doing that. This shouldn't take very long. Shouldn't. If you could hit weapons, I would be most pleased with that. But you can't. See if you can get weapons. Apparently it's not that good of a chance to get them, but you know, you can always get lucky, right? No. Alright, that's fine. Um, we will upgrade the shields now, unless there's another store right next to this, which there isn't. <clears throat> oh no, my weapon systems. Right, we don't have that. Yeah, go after it. We got level 2 shields. Moving on. Surrender their goods, right? They're really trying to run. They do not seem to be having a teleporter. So we'll start the abduction process. We will have to give them some stuff to repair <coughs> before they get a chance to run, though. Setting that on fire can help. But not hitting anything else? Not really. Could you start hitting other systems, please? Thank you. Jeez. Man, that wasn't so hard, was it? Did I really have to take four hours? Or something similar? Let's stop. My control. Come with me. Join the... Um, dark side, because we don't need interior lighting. I don't know. Maybe. Alright, 10 more seconds and we can take that last douche with us. So it doesn't rip. Oh, well, that didn't take very long, did it? Yeah, let's hope it stays out of sync until we kill him. Yeah, that didn't take long, did it? Hey, oh yeah, mine launcher. Well, oh, it's a weapon. I don't have a weapon system yet, though. And immediately trying to run as well. What is up with all these chickens? Somebody tell me, please. I want to know. He didn't even care. Like, pff, whatever, right? Take him. I don't need him. Hell. <clears throat> Keep shooting. Wouldn't mind another hit on weapons or slow down repairs on his end. It's amazing that we dodge as many shots as we actually are. Oh, you will have to stop now. Eh, I can do one more. There you go. Alright, 25% more evasion. That's when you get hit. See? Ah, I'm just too good. Say what you want, but my predictions often 
or a good thing. You bump up your evasion and that's when they say no, you're gonna get hit. Anyway, let's move on. Into an asteroid field. Oh, brilliant. Okay, so you need to get mind controlled. I'm not in any danger unless two asteroids come in close after another. I don't think that can actually happen. So those are two NGs, right? Uh, yeah, looks like it. I thought one of them would have been a rock one, but it's an NG. So we'll just take him away straight away. It means he might get shot up by his own buddy a bit. How such a small laser can make such a big hole, I will never know. Yes, repair the breach that you just caused. Okay. Because I don't need the crew member, that's for sure. Three free fuel, that's nice. Uh, we'll attack, yeah, you can't really do anything to us. I mean, you can set fire to our ship, but who cares? I mean, really, what you, what's the plan on that one, huh? So the Rockman needs to be softened up a little bit before we take him in. Otherwise, he's going to destroy some stuff. Now he won't. And the rest you can now take one by one. That's one, two, three, four people, which is going to take a while, so I'm going to pause it and get back to you when I'm taking over the last one. Alright. Time to take in that last boy. Yeah. You know it's over. So what do we really want on this ship? Well, weapons are a thing. But it's a 90 scrap. Uh, free the slave and drop him off. It's a 90 scrap investment if you want two bars, two bars of weapon powers. We actually had a bit of a discussion about that, whether we should let you start off with one or two and you actually buy it. Um, by discussion, I mean I suggested he said no. And I said, okay, it's your ship, do whatever you see fit. Um, I'm easy going with that, so. Anyway, yeah, that's the thing. Um, uh, I can go here and then do the store and then start going to those quest markers. Attack! Because we seem to be safe. And it will only cost us a drone part. Um, I mean, if you have an opinion on that, be. Well, feel free to give it. We're always looking for someone else to blow a bit of fresh air into this crazy collaboration. Dude, could you like stop missing? I wonder how they do that. I mean. It's all RNG, but it does seem like you miss more shots on AI ships. Hmm. Weird. Well, in any case. <clears throat> Quests, quests. Let's see if we can find weapons. Or a drone wreck arm and another offensive drone. Life support, cloaking, light defense. Scrap recovery arm, drone uplink jammer. 
I can go back to that, that store if there's nothing in there. If there's no weapons in there. Let's see if we find something here. No. Alright, let's go back to that one. And we'll buy the light defense drone for missile defense. Let's grab a covery arm as well. Might not be the smartest thing to be doing, but... <clears throat> At least we got missile defense, which is something. I'm not going to be using drones because it's a slim chance that this is going to hit twice, which is why we need to take that out. So that probably will fire once more, maybe twice. I'm guessing twice, looking at things. Hmm. <clears throat> maybe just once. Hopefully just once. Yeah, that's looking like another that's looking like another shot actually. Uh, no. Burst laser mark two. You know, I haven't seen this weapon in ages. Naturally, I should be getting one on a ship that doesn't even have a weapon system on it. <coughs> Leave it to me, I guess. Ah, well. FTL things, right? Really? Two breaches? How the hell did you pull that one off with a pixel beam? Hmm. The game surprised me yet. Well. At least once we get weapons, we'll uh, <clears throat> be able to power up a pretty good weapon with it, right? Lots of combat to be had. And this is where the crap begins. Why? Because we're facing level 2 shielded enemies already. Hmm. Really? He can stack his ion damage? Hmm. Odd. Odd. I will admit, that is odd. Alright, we're safe. We might as well keep this thing going until magic happens, I guess. Meaning, if the drone manages to hit shields, and then we can actually destroy it, but... I don't know. Well, there you have it. <clears throat> Just give it plenty of time and it'll do its job eventually. Hmm. Huh. Okay. Well now. Didn't I have... Yeah, I do have weapons in stored. Problem is I don't have a system. Ugh, it's confusing not having weapons. This is only a one-layered one. But it's targeting my drones. 
It destroyed my repair drone, you bastard. I really got a hit off as well. <clears throat> Alright, this shouldn't take much longer. Hope he doesn't get to hack again. Okay. Not one of you. It is in the eye sector or something. Clash of the AI ships. Doing a really good job at hitting that empty room, though. I have to admit. <clears throat> Ain't nobody gonna tell you otherwise. Hmm. Now we're starting to miss. <laughs> Ah, uh, brilliant, brilliant. All right, one more fight, then we'll go to the next sector, and then we might have a chance to find another store that maybe that'll help us. Um, you don't seem to be posing too much of a threat. And I was correct in assuming that. I wonder if you'll counter our mind control with your own. I don't think it's going to matter too much. You are not countering. Ah, uh, at the stretch there. Sorry if you heard any weird noises. The scrap is going to start rolling in soon, but all the scrap in the world can't save you if you can't spend it properly. And that is going to be a big problem soon. If you do not find the weapons, we're boned. I suppose hacking could work. Artillery could work. It'll be interesting, that's for damn sure. What do we have here? A Pulsar. A Pulsar is good if it's actually a Pulsar in the list. And by actually a Pulsar, I mean it could have been a black hole and it wouldn't be the first time for that to have happened either. Um, we're gonna be spending quite a few, well, quite a few. Two isn't really quite a few, but you know. Let's try to go for weapons. Resist, resist. That's gonna hurt. Yep. Alright, good. And there goes another drone part. Three drone parts in one fight. All in the dubious name of science. Oh, you switched out your weapons, you jerkwad. No, you actually just repaired your stuff. Eeeh, shite. Well, they got another shot off, but I'll be gone. Uh, hull 
Assault Missile Mark 1. Invaded. I don't think I can do that, because that sounds like Lanius. I kind of need to stay away from Lanius. Alright, so we're boned unless we find a store immediately. I suppose we could keep this up until he runs out of drone parts. And this sucks. Pretty badly. I'm just gonna try and run. With my slow as hell engines. So artillery can save me, hacking can save me, weapon control can save me. Uh, that's kind of it. Well, wish us luck. Because hell, we're going to need it. Uh, stores are nowhere to be found, though. <clears throat> Let's check up there. Nothing here either. Alright. Fuck it. We'll keep running if you have to. But it doesn't look like we're gonna get any time any doesn't look like we're gonna get a store anytime soon. You're level one, so we have to take you down. You don't pose an immediate threat to us. And we're gonna take out the NG because he's good at repairs. Uh <sighs> man, we need stuff, and that's kind of the problem with this ship. You're really heavily reliant on the RNG for more than one reason. First of all, you don't have any weapons, which means you need the RNG to give you a weapon system. Second of all, since you don't have weapons and you're relying on the Combat 3, a Combat 3 is unguided fire, which means you're relying on the RNG for the Combat Drone at something. Not great, but oh right, oh, I thought the engines would blow out. Well, go get him. <clears throat> We're gonna take our friend here with us. He can help us repair us over a little bit. I don't know if we're ever gonna be piercing three layers. I'm sort of hoping no, but I don't know. And now I don't need to care either. <clears throat> oh, come on. A store with weapons is all we need. Really. To keep this bucket of bolts flying. Hi, Fen. Alright, give me, give me a system I can use. Uh, this is another leftover from the slug gel, so I'm not going to be using it. Nothing I can use, that's unfortunate. That is... I have to. I just have to. Hmm. <clears throat> Not getting the stuff I want really, really hurts, but that's the name of the game, right? Another chance, <clears throat> but I'm thinking this one won't even have systems. Hey, 
It has them, but not the ones we want. Simply buying systems to improve the chance of getting good ones isn't really a smart idea. <coughs> but now if we need we can get two combat drones up, which will put an even bigger strain on our already dwindling reserves. But what can we do really? We'll tank the shots. I can't keep using three drone parts on every fight. Eh, we've just lost the drone. Yep. <laughs> After such a long time, I finally get a burst laser or two and I never get to use it. FTL in a nutshell, right? fine if our shields were both up. See, I'm constantly holding on to scrap until we come across something that I can actually use. Um, I did a short test run on this as well, and it does seem like I kept lacking the basic stuff I needed to just get a semi-good run cobbled together. Um, I don't know why. Um, Consider that I'm now looking against a 90 scrap investment to get Burst Laser 2 up, if I ever get the chance to get it up. I don't know. We'll keep going, we're way too far ahead. I think it's Sector 5 already or something? Another what? Sector 3. Yeah, going to Sector 5. <coughs> I don't know, man. If I don't find weapons or a no decent system soon, we're just straight up done. It doesn't happen that often that you get a ship where you have almost half your reactor left in power with nothing to do with them. Those are gonna sync up, aren't they? Yeah, but a shot of your miss. So, that's nice. See, the board, <coughs> the abduction strategy is something you can always rely on. I know that. You also do need the time in order to do it. And once you come across the ice ships, well, good luck, you know? I have never really got to use the abduction strategy, mainly because I never really appreciated the mind control system and the teleporter combined. Like no stores. Come on, man! Throw me a bone here.
anything. <clears throat> nope. <laughs> Just isn't happening. Ah, poor little old me. And I can't use my drones. Yep. That's kind of the opposite of throwing a bone. That's uh, more leaning towards a death sentence. There's got to be a store around here somewhere, right? Not even boarding yet. Will you at least kill someone? Nope. Will you at least board? Mm, no. You boarded with the Zoltan. Um, not sure what to think of that. Are you actually going to be able to destroy that? No, he won't. Store, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Weapon control. Soon we'll even repair because there's a glimmer of hope for us yet. <clears throat> All right. Um, light defense. Uh, we don't have to worry about anything anymore. And then there was brief hope. Alright, so you get to see the weapons on this thing. Um, Uh, I will do the abduction thing, right? Yes. That's my dastardly plan all along. I don't know why I'm shooting at them. It's just the fact that I can shoot at them. Feels good, you know? Finally being able to shoot. Alright, stop now because I want you to kill him first. Good old weapon system. So we got three shots from this, another one from that. All right, we might be able to still squeeze out a victory. Uh, 
I think we're gonna go take revenge, shall we? Yes. Feels good. Feels good. Ah, sweet revenge. No. Told you this was revenge. <clears throat> yeah, man. I have this little check how far we actually had to go before we got weapons. I did a brief test run way back just to see if weapons did show up. And I think I got it twice on three stores that offered weapons. We're now halfway past sector four before I encountered it the first time, so anyway, I'm kinda done complaining unless I found a find a kill ship now, which wouldn't be out of the <gasps> <laughs> Good. If you want something just straight up dead, you can make it happen now. So many drones. Um, well, this isn't really a perfect spot to figure out how much power we need, is it? Don't give me that ass. Straight out of the gates, asteroids BS, okay? And you did. Yeah. Do we abduct someone straight away? No, we have to let them fight one another a bit. Which we can easily do once they move both to there. I don't know if they're gonna stay in there, I think they will. Yes. Alright, let him duke it out. Now we can start abducting him. Could let them kill themselves, I know. It must be really smelly in this corridor. How many people would have died in there already this run? I don't know. Oh no, it had weapons, uh, shields. But he's going to fix it. Good boy. Good boy. Nope. Alright, he fixed the shields. Good. Now we just need to abduct him before the fire spreads two shields, and we have even more issues. Hmm. Come on. I'll save you. <laughs> yeah. And if you don't believe that, I'll spin you another tale.
can upgrade here. <coughs> upgrade the reactor by one. Well, thank you. There's a store which, if I jump in, probably can't get to. So we're just gonna go this, this, and that to the exit. Ship. Aim. Weapons, no need. Seeing how we do have missile defense. Stacking, I can't help but noticing that. Lucky fire, I know. I might have stopped that one, but it didn't end up making a difference. The plan that was listed as a safe haven for Federation forces, but obviously the mafias have taken over here as well. The local defenders don't yet kindly to ships representing a centralized galactic government. Well, screw you too. That weapon doesn't fear me one bit. No teleporter, which means I shouldn't have that big of a problem. Can I actually get hurt? No. <clears throat> that only has two shots. That can't pierce, and that can't pierce. And that doesn't take away shields. And that weapon can actually only help us, because if it hits crew and it's on board, it'll die quicker. Am I right? So, the Rockman took over that, which is good, because I'm going to micro him next, which means he will take some... No, that doesn't matter. What am I talking about? I might as well just take him straight on with me. Alright, come on. Hey. What? Uh, hmm? Okay, that's new. Don't go for the breach. Uh. Now it must be quite a pain for you, having all those fancy weapons and nothing that can hurt me. I know the feeling. I've been in that before. Quite recently. Well, I'm probably going to end the episode after this one. So I might as well start off the goodbyes already. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you're still enjoying the series. Feel free to show support by commenting, liking, and or subbing if you haven't already. Feel free to use the comment section below if you have anything to say about the ship for yourself. So, like I said, we could always use some extra opinions and whatnot. It comes down to bassing. Because in the end, at the end of all things, we're creating these ones for you. 
Anyway, see you guys on the next episode then. I thought you would be dead already. Ah, there you go. Alright. Bye, everyone. <laughs>